Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Anna and today I actually came to share with you um, a few Michaels items but I still had some of my Shein stuff that I had on here so um, I guess I'll share this with you first. I'm not too sure if I shared this with you guys already but I don't think I did. Um, this is a, a measuring tape. I did get two and they're really cute. As you can tell, they're fuzzy, soft, and then there's the tape. And then you can press that button and it'll stop right here in the middle. And it's a measuring tape. Yeah. And it's super cute. So the little button's right there. Um, like I said, I did get two of them because I thought that they were absolutely adorable. Yay. So I did get that. Make sure the second one works well too. Let me see. Uh, let's see. Yeah, stopping. And then it clicks back. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Then I did get this really pretty um, string of beads. I did just place um, another order. And I do have things I still haven't shared with you. So there will be more. So this one I thought was absolutely gorgeous because it has like this Aurora Borealis type of look to it. Rainbowish. Really pretty. Um, and it's glass. That's just going to look gorgeous um, when I make some jewelry with it. And that is what it's for. Making jewelry. I'm going to put this over here. I got two. I think I got them for a dollar each. Sorry, I, I can't remember the prices. This was from a while ago. Then I get three sets of this one. Um, these are just different size. It comes just like this. The kit comes just like this. I, I want to say maybe I paid 2 or $3 for this entire kit. And you get the different sizes. I'll open them up for you real quick. Um, of the filigree. I don't want them to all fall out. I'll just open up two or three of them so you can see they do come in different sizes. So as you can see it comes in different sizes. Um, this type of filigree. There you go. It looks like that. Can, can you guys see that? I know I can't see myself and what I'm doing in this. Um, there we go. So they look like that but they're all in different sizes. Okay. And I love that. Big bang boom. And it was cheap. So I got three sets. This is great for dollhouse miniatures and other small type um, projects. So I got three of those. One, two, three. Let me make sure that everything is kosher. Let's see. Yeah. yeah. And this last one. Let's see, because I wasn't checking stuff. There we go. Okay, so it's one, two, three right there. Perfect. Okay. Then um, I did get these uh, horses. These are key rings. Um, there we go. Key rings. I'm pretty sure I shared these with you guys already, but they were sitting right here, so I'm, I'll go ahead and just do it. Uh, so they look like horses, and I thought that would be perfect for dollhouse miniatures. Look at all the detail absolutely amazing and you see the size of it compared to my finger it's going to be a really nice unique piece and you did get two for one price so that's going to be nice and i did get this necklace they have several different kinds um this is a big chunky piece it is made out of like a plastic uh, so it's a very lightweight you can wear also on the back if you want to just have a solid very organic type of a look um but it does have a very beautiful um, sheen to it. Then it has the little um, beads on the top, the little matchy matchy beads right there on the top, and then this is the cord. So you could just throw this on with almost anything um, and look super cute. Then I get this. I got this tape, and it's a really thick tape. So yeah, I got this thick tape. Not terribly exciting, but it is tape. Then um, this was an ear, uh, an ear for the ear, an ear clip. I just took the pieces off. This is from Shein. 
and I'm going to put this on a project because I thought it was so cool looking and it's a um, a dragon see that so I thought that would look cool on a on a project and I did get two of the horses I did get two of these okay cool I'm glad I did because once they sell out for stuff you never know when you're going to get to see them again you know you don't you just don't know so that's a good one to have then I got this and it has the little birds in it the little birdies I know you guys should be able to see that the little birdies they're like bird houses with little birds on the inside I thought that would be charming for on top of a mantle or something you know for dollhouse miniatures you know miniature related then they had these little handles right and um let's pop her open here which way do we go we go this way which way do we go dolly i just don't know and they do come with the nails but i will not need the nails because i'm just going to put this on you know any one of my projects that i might be working on they're cute little handles that you can add to any project junk journal or whatever that you might have but like I said they do come with these little nails but I won't be necessarily using these nails just the handles then I have these um, they look like uh, tickets and these are also from from there and I think the I want to say I would like to say that they're all like the same possibly I'm trying to break it with my nail and it's not working and I am in my craft room and I don't know where my scissors are because I think my sons my sons like to come in here and get supplies to do their stuff they do lots of arts and crafts and they like to create things and I encourage that so they come in here a lot to take what they need and I always say, go ahead, go upstairs, go get what you need. So scissors is always a thing that tends to disappear here. I'm just trying to show you what this thing looks like if this, if I can ever get into it. <laughs> this is crazy. I don't want to mess this up. This plastic is like no joke. Man, they know how to seal these suckers up. There we go, you guys. We did it. We did it, y'all. Okay, so they look like tickets and you slide them out see I didn't even know that not cute you slide them out and I don't know are they different oh yeah they're different okay so they're looking like this here in the top then as as you can see it's like two sheets of each of the different designs okay really cool looking vintagey really cool I know I know you don't you're not getting the whole picture here but you you get the you get the gist of it just really cool looking um, things for paper projects as you could tell just really cool looking and it's a good amount and then it comes uh, together with this right here so that's convenient at least I thought it was I thought it was let me try to put this in here okay there we go so we got that then um, these were a pair of earrings and I just took all the little pieces off so I could use them for my dollhouse but they were a pair of earrings from Shein and I just took off all the components okay and I'll put this on in front of another mirror and it'll just look like a little um, stained glass effect then I did get this set of um, brushes and these are cosmetic brushes y'all but I got this so I can use it to dab and um, stain the edges to papers and all that good stuff you know when you grab something like this and then you dab it dab 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 so it's a whole bunch of brushes in different in different sizes and they were a really good price so I'm gonna use these as dabbers and they come like I said you know nice and thick feel really good these actually be really nice for cosmetics 
they're, they're really nice. Wow, that's really nice. But I'm going to use it for arts and crafts because that's how I roll, baby. Then I did get these little, like, figurines. I don't know if they're stickers. I can't remember if they're stickers or not. But let's take a really quick look-see together. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. So it's different figures here. And they have some newer ones available right now. They do. I know I'm dropping them, but it's okay. They do have some newer ones. Um, I don't think they're stickers. No, they're just paper pieces. So I'd definitely have to... Um, use glue to put them down but as you can tell they're different they're all different very pretty okay very pretty but they're not stickers though so if you need a sticker you don't want to deal with glue and stuff down don't get these because you definitely will need some glue you will and they are made out of paper so you can't go crazy with the glue or it might buckle a little bit because it is made out of paper Okay, then the next thing is this paper pack here, and it has like this whole vintage vibe to it. I love these because they just make your life so much easier when you're trying to create stuff so you don't have to print things out because I don't have a printer, you guys. But let me show you. It's like different music sheets, okay? Okay, and um, they're playing in the back though. So you could technically just put them back to back if you're trying to put inserts and very quickly put an insert and it looks vintage. It has that whole little tea dyed kind of look to it. And then you just put your dabber and, you know, you know, take care of that. So that's a really nice set that I got as well. Then I did get these seam markers. And it came in this really big pack for my sewing kit. These seam rippers. Um, these are awesome for all kinds of projects. And I like the fact that they came. I think this one's. I don't know if this look goes with this one. Yeah, this one's like really small. Yeah, that one's like really small. Okay. Well, anyways. Yeah, so seam rippers and it came in a big old kit like this i did order some new um sewing supply items so those are coming too so you'll get to see this once they come in the mail then lastly i did get this um and it looks like an octopus and it's black and it's just really cool looking so yeah so don't be surprised if you see me rocking this one day that's where i got it from from shein and um looks like it has like a little bit of something coming off of there but this side i'll just wear this side it looks really cool look how big it is that'll look really cool and i like the black chain it looks awesome okay so i'm going to come back and do a michael's haul share a few things i picked up from michael so make sure you come back and i'll see you guys in a bit bye